Greetings, Internet, and welcome to another episode of A Comedy Musician Reacts. My name is Insane Ian, and I am a comedy musician, and I react. I'm also a comedy music fan. On this show, we react to songs from the perspective of someone who also does comedy music. Be it construction of jokes and how the song and video amplifies those jokes, or sometimes it's just appreciation of the humor and laughing at it and reacting to it thus like. It's a crapshoot on what you're gonna get, but hopefully it's always entertaining. This week I'm reacting to a brand new song by the stupendium, No One's Home, their Beholder 3 song that just went up last week. Again, We've come into a situation where Stupendium is doing a song about a game that I've never even heard of. Not only have I not heard of it, this is apparently the third game in a series that I've never heard of. Neat. That does not ever diminish my appreciation for these songs, and sometimes for the games. There have been several games that the Stupendium has done songs for that I have ended up purchasing. Death and Taxes, Evil Genius 2, there's a handful of them. I actually just started playing We Happy Few last night uh, based on enjoying Stupendium's song about it. But anyway, before we do all of that, if you happen to like this video, please click the like button. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Do all the things to feed the algorithm to get more eyeballs on these videos. And if you really want to help the channel out, consider supporting me on Patreon, where patrons get these videos early, get my music early, get your name in the end credits, all sorts of good stuff like that there. Occasionally we have polls on Patreon where you can vote on what songs you want me to react to next. Uh, sometimes I keep those to being stupendium songs because there's a lot. Uh, and actually, I've, I've gone through most of their catalog, but uh, yeah, all sorts of other good things. Also, uh, from June 9th to, I believe, the 14th, I'm having a 20% off sale on my Spreadshirt shop, my Spread shop, where you can get my name and logo emblazoned upon your head and torso with hats and t-shirts and various other things with my stuff on it. Yeah, go check out uh, the Spread Shop. Link is in the description below, or there is a little handy merch bar down there as well. And links throughout the video as well. Yeah, I do stuff. Anyway, that's enough yammering. Let's dive in to this very creepy looking video. I, I wasn't sure it was going to be comedy. Uh, and it may not be comedy directly, but Stupendium assures me that it's tongue-in-cheek enough for me, so I'll take their word for it. Let's dive in. Oh, also, the song features Maguire on the hook. Yeah. The Ministry reminds all citizens that their subscriptions are monitored. A little epilepsy warning there at the beginning, good to know. For the safeguarding of our society's cultural integrity. You would do well to subscribe to this stupendium immediately. Follow that direction. Ooh. It's my pleasure to welcome you to your new home in apartment two with one bedroom and a splendid view. Just don't forget when the rent is due. It's very Sin City esque in the uh visual style of the music video itself, although that animated portion at the beginning, a little different than what Stupendium does. It was a little... Uh, I don't know if that's from, from in-game or if that was Stupendium's animation there, but it was... It, stylistically, it looked a little different than what they usually do. Uh, also, right out the gate, coming in hard, digging it. We expect all residents to abide by identity rules Keep quiet, keep clean, keep telling the truth Grace and evidence of any elements who have better to do Than to comply with our societal requirements Those who stay in line might just survive until retirement Ooh, that's a tasty little pocket of flow right there The societal requirements and then what was the, the other? The societal requirements Those who stay in line might just survive until retirement. Societal requirements survive until retirement. That is a tasty little rhyme. That is really, really good. I dig that a lot. But I'm really getting some hardcore heavy Kevin vibes from Sin City, who you always saw wearing the glasses, but you never saw their, his eyes because the, the glasses were always whited out on the frames. And this is something Stupendium has done in numerous videos, too, but with the red tie, red being really the only color on screen. 
It's very Sin City vibes. The first Sin City movie, great, uh, if not slightly problematic because of the source material. Uh, the second Sin City movie, not good, not, not good. I do plan on doing videos about comic book adaptations eventually. Maybe I'll dive into that one and exactly why. But anyway, back to this thing that I'm doing currently. Just survive until retirement. burns. Pay no mind as I inquire just why the other night you went to the laundry room to hide an item in the dryer. Fred is obvious state provided, and yet be wise, be grateful. Side with every regulation, and you'll find food on the table. It's not a state provided. You find decadence is wasteful. It's been perfect since the state decided what decor is tasteful. As Stupendium again, going for the uh, the evil bureaucratic side. I'm the person watching over you. I, I guess they are the beholder, the one who beholds all the things. It, it just... they like playing villains. That's really what it boils down to. Uh, and that seems what uh, they are reveling in in this song as well. Evil. So evil you have to see it's evil, like it's the fruits of the devil. I've quoted this before, so I am already an axe murderer. It's good. Property manager, my job is sorting the utilities, disposal of the garbage in the laundering facilities. Why would I compile a full report on your activities? I'm just a standard landlord. Glory to the ministry. Glory to the ministry. I think that's the overarching evil entity in the game. I, I saw something in the description about the ministry, so yeah. I think that's... Uh, also, again, the, the the just intricate flow that he's got in there with the different pockets of rhymes, just top shelf all the way. Nice. Like, just real, like, smooth. To get through the day, it behoves you to play with the rules of the hate. With the state, we approve all the tunes you play. When alone in a room, will to whom do you pray? Assume that your neighbors are moving away. When the black man comes at the night, and you're numb to the sight of another one fumbling for someone to hide. As the white is runs for the life, all the ones where the guns can arrive. Are they gone for the sun's gonna rise to a god, my provided bonker for some realignment? It's just fine, you could judge it's a wonderful time. Whoa! That old second verse beginning. And, like, I'm sure we're only halfway through the second verse. That was incredible. That was just... Uh, uh, mind-meltingly good. That... good. I said good. I, my mind was melted, so my consonants and vowels decided to have a party in my mouth. Sure, that's a thing that happened. Uh... Ah, that was great. Just go about your business normally, no one's following, I'm not recording Your paranoia is awfully boring, according to all of your friends that told to me Most importantly, please be clear when you broke out to your own estate and the law will record me my I love this section too, because they're going through, through and it's... They're installing all of the security cameras that they're in that room observing and everything. You see them working on one with a screwdriver, I think that was a camera they were working on, but, you know, the whole monitoring setup and now watching them put the cameras up while they're recording so you're seeing it from that perspective of the installation is really really interesting and it's a really stupendium always does this the the craft that they put into their music videos is such a step beyond anybody working and doing these things now there's so much even for the things that they claim are smaller productions are still big productions when compared to anyone else in the game. They're, they're just so intricate and involved and detailed and detail-oriented. There is never a, a wasted frame, a shot that it's filler. Everything is completely carefully plotted out and purposely executed and inserted into its place. Everything fits in like a puzzle piece. The, the, the amount of craft that is into any of their compositions, not just song making, but video making, uh, is stunning and uh, humbling. 
provided my to tiny I can trust my brother I, I, I have to go back and listen to that verse again because I was so stunned by what was happening and yammered on about it. Well, God, my provided bunker for some realignment. It's just fine, you could judge a wonderful time. Just go about your business normally, no one's following, I'm not recording. Your paranoia is awfully boring, according to all of your friends that told me more. I'm not recording, they say, as they're putting up cameras. I, ooh, uh, lying dichotomies. Yes. Importantly, please be clear when you broke out the door and it's not in the law where economy might provide in mind to tiny and I can't trust my brother. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not recording you, but please speak clearly because the tiny microphones I've installed, I, I can't uh, transcribe what they're hearing. <laughs> okay, there's the tongue in cheek stuff. Oh, yes, nothing illicit happening here. I'm not trying to watch you through the keyhole, I'm just. Checking the keyhole for maintenance. We don't want any rust in there. We want everything to work properly. I'm the custodian of the building, not some person who's watching every move that you make. Genius. Love it. Ooh. Okay, that's an excellent flip. Never mind what the, the red light you see flashing in your room. That's not a camera. That's, that's from your smoke alarm. That's all that is. A little gas lighting. A little double meaning there, of course, because, you know, sometimes fire alarms are also CO2 alarms, where they can tell the presence of gas in the home. And, of course, gas lighting is telling somebody you're imagining something. This is not really what's happening. I get it. It's good stuff. Ooh, I was waiting for the rifle flip on that. Rifling through means rapidly going through someone's files or uh, property. You're rifling through their trash, you're rifling through their, their filing cabinet, you're rifling through their belongings, meaning you're rapidly going through it looking for something. But also rifle meaning rifle, you know. You're going to be faced with a different type of rifle, too. Yeah. Excellent. It's, it, it's always that quality wordplay that, you know, words have multiple meanings. And, and using those multiple meanings within the same bar is, again, another one of Stupendium's specialties. You had something illicit in your home, you were found with it, you didn't put it there, they put it there. And, uh, they could forget the indiscretion if you pay them. I'm, I'm starting to see what, what this angle is. Again, loves playing a villain. Loves playing a villain. Is that what the gameplay actually looks like? I, again, know nothing about this game, so I, I'm seeing sections that are in this particular style, so I'm guessing that's actually what the gameplay looks like. I don't know, but uh, if it is, cool. I'm sure everyone will tell me in the comments below. Thanks. You will find that the spying is really quite just desirable. Why are you crying when it's your blind eye that's liable? Ooh. Ooh, that's a good line, too. Why are you crying when it's when you're blind eye that's liable? You know, when you turn a blind eye to something, that means you're going to ignore it. You're going to not pay attention to something, and in this case they're saying that it's something you should be paying attention to. Why are you upset when you turned a blind eye to it, making you liable? You were the one who ignored the thing that was clearly happening, and now you're upset because of the outcome. Why? when it was your fault for turning the blind eye to it. I love these flips. Well, 
landlord here to fix your ventilation whistling Too many questions and it's not the air that needs conditioning That telephone's not tampered with, of course it isn't listening But worry, it prefers the words glory to the ministry Again, going back to the theme about glory to the ministry and the, uh, the air that, it's not the air that needs conditioning. Not meaning hair conditioner, like, I know that sort of air conditioner, hair conditioner, that's not what I meant. Like, shampoo and conditioner, I don't mean that. But like, reprogramming or changing someone's mind about something is also called conditioning them. You're being conditioned to think a certain way. It's, it's language like that that makes these things so fun, because I, I, I know Stupendium, and by proxy, when I react to Stupendium songs, we have people who English is not a first language for. So sometimes idioms and breakdowns of phrases like that, where words have multiple meanings, sometimes can get lost in translation for people who are not regular or fluent English speakers. At least that's the, the impression I've gotten from the comments. So, uh, breaking those things down and also appreciating them. I, mean, I, I coming at it from a person who does speak English and just appreciating the flip of having words that have double meanings and using those double meanings in a meaningful way in the lyrics of the song is really impressive. And that's usually the only reason that I'm pointing them out. But I also know that some people appreciate when I do that, so you're being hurt. Uh, this is this is phenomenal. Again, not 100% comedy, but there are enough cleverness uh, in the lines that, that makes it, I think, worthwhile for at least this type of show that I do. I try to react only to comedy music because I'm a comedy musician and, and I'm trying to give my perspective on something that's humorous. Um, when it's not humorous, I'm only able to do a certain amount of things with the reaction, but uh, that's why I, I only do comedy music. Um, that said, at least I have something to say about this particular song. Um, it's definitely clever. There are definitely some tongue-in-cheek lines that I am appreciating, um, uh, and Stupendium certainly seems to revel in being the villain, and that in itself knowing Stupendium is enjoyable and fun. Yeah. Ooh, that's a different flip too. Saying no one is home, no one is at home, but also no one's home, it, meaning it is it. The home belongs to no one. It's no one's home. Uh, that was not in the first chorus. It's in this one, and also Maguire's voice, excellent, super, super groovy smoothness, excellent stuff. Really appreciate that. Also on the camera. On the screen there, it said McGuire Cam, <laughs> saying which room you're looking at. Usually, it'll say on the on your monitors, and that one was McGuire Cam, uh, just with less letters to spell it out. What was that? Did not understand that word. So someone from the ministry is watching the other person from the ministry, I guess? Interesting. Appreciate your compliance in watching this video. And extend our thanks to our most loyal of tenants on Patreon. Oh, my name was there. Cultural endeavors such as this possible. Let it be known that the resident Maguire has been taken into custody. Oh. For possession of an incredible singing voice held without license. <laughs> For possession of an incredible singing voice held without license. Someone no one will ever... Something no one will ever say about me. Something, not someone. I... See, words are fun with my face. I say weird things like that, and it ends up in compilation videos about me out of context, I'm sure. That was phenomenal. That was just a really good song. Again, for a song I don't know any, or a game I don't know anything about. If you did not enjoy, 
the ministry mandates that you do so anyway. <laughs> and to learn the state secrets of how these videos get made, we advise you pay a visit to the Stupendium Patreon. Oh yeah. In the meantime, thank you for watching. We'll be returning the favor. Thank you for watching. We'll be returning the favor, meaning uh, we'll be watching you. Oh man. Excellent stuff. Also, yes, absolutely check out Stupendium Patreon. They have behind the scenes and sometimes green screen videos on how the video came together. I know they did a green screen video of this song, which is just the song without the effects attached. So it's just on the green screen, no effects on the shots. Uh, sometimes there's more in-depth behind the scenes things on their Patreon. Worth checking out. Uh, fantastic stuff. Really, really cool. Uh, go, of course, check out the video in the description below if you haven't already. And if you haven't, why are you watching a reaction to it before seeing it? Whatever. I, you're, I'm not your boss. You can do whatever the hell you want. Uh, also, if you'd like to do whatever the hell you want, please, I'm asking you politely to kindly like, share, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed this and uh, help get more eyes on it and feed the algorithm. And, of course, if you want to support the channel, Patreon is there for my stuff as well, or, you know, getting my merch. Anyway, enough selling of things, apparently. This has been fun. I'll see you next time. Bye. Corey can't even deal with this. He can't even say what Corey